<laughs> Better made. Came up with them thoroughbred swap world that was Detroit City. Moved out to the Gold State, California. I ain't come from love with me. Focus like Adderall. When I had a ball, I shattered boys. Shack fool in the 9 2 with vocab boy like Scattergore. One kid, but I'm sunny. What up, everybody? I'm Mark. This is Inworld Closet Collection. Thanks for hitting my channel up. If you're on videos on the freshest and the best kicks, merch, etc., be sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Shout out to Little Master for the reminder. Today, we're going to be unboxing and reviewing the new Nike Air Jordan 6 Travis Scott collab in the British Khaki colorway. These shoes dropped on April 30th for the price of 250 bucks. So I almost had a raffle on his website was the night before, I'm almost certain. Then the next morning, they dropped on sneakers and all the raffle reveals. I struck out everywhere. But then on his website, he re-released another raffle and I hopped in, put my size in, size 13. And then I seen tweets like people saying, oh, you know, they're putting out wins. I checked my email. <laughs> and I had an invoice in there, I couldn't believe it. So I made sure I copped them right away, and then they came maybe like two or three days ago. But when they originally put the raffle up on the website, it had like uh, shorts, shirts, like vests, pants, like with Jordan collab. And I had a few things in my cart already because he had some other stuff just in there waiting. I guess like the Astro World stuff was coming up. So I had stuff in my cart already, and I put the shorts in, the t-shirt, then I went back and removed some other things from my cart that I was like, on the fence about. And that was a mistake because the shirt sold out before I checked out, but I still got with the, the shorts and the shorts are like uh, swim trunks. So I'm happy to have these shorts. I might keep them, might not, we'll see. But in this video, we're gonna unbox the shoes and we're gonna get the shorts. Let's check out the shorts real quick. So these came relatively quick. Like I ordered them on the 30th and, well, 29th I wanna say. And it came like within a week, less than a week. It came before the shoes. Let's check them out. These are super nice. Yeah, I think honestly, like the material is very, it's like thick. And these are swim trunks. Um, we got the lining on the inside. They have pockets. Gotta have pockets in my trunks. And it has a back pocket. And this is a nice, pretty secure back pocket. Got skulls on it. Got a cactus. Uh, more skulls and flames. These are nice. I might keep these for personal. These would be some good, like, <laughs> like pool party trunks. Let me grab my shank, turn the safety off. Because remember, safety first. Remember, you can cut up a box to always cut away. Always cut away. Because trust me, you don't want to get shanked. Discard that. All right, let's get them out the box. discard that all right so first of all this box is heavy <laughs> like heavy heavy i'm guess i'm hoping some like surprises in here because the shoes themselves can't cannot be this heavy um and this box could possibly have some weight to it but i'm not sure uh it's a jordan box um got cactus jack on around the side got the cactus jack logo here and the cactus jack on the back but I'm telling you, this box is heavy, y'all. Um, then the size tag says Air Jordan 6 Retro SP, US size 13. The colorway is British Khaki, bright crimson. Let's check them out, y'all. All right, so I got a dust bag, and this dust bag is light, but it's a, a Jordan dust bag slash backpack. It's kind of nice. Let's look at the shoes. <laughs> these are like remind me of a camel <laughs> and there you have it the nike air jordan 6 travis scott collaboration in the british khaki colorway let me know initial thoughts in the comment section down below all right so much thoughts of this shoe uh, this is a very nice shoe uh i feel like the quality is very good um, and it's a clean shoe, like very wearable. It's top to review. So start on the lateral side at the bottom, you can see this outsole spilling up and the outsole is uh, glow in the dark. <laughs> it looks true glow in the dark material. I know it glows cause I've seen pictures and in this video we will make them glow. <laughs> uh, this window back here is kind of like it's indented. So I'm not certain with Jordan 6's cause I'm not a huge Jordan fan like that. 
and the only sixes I ever had before that I could recall, for sure, right? In 2019, I had the green, the olive green pair. I won on sneakers. I remember that day because I didn't get a got them. I didn't get an email or nothing for like hours, but it was pending out of my account. And I'm like, I had to get them. And then finally, I get the confirmation. And those shoes were suede as well, but it was a thinner suede than this. And I don't recall, I didn't do videos back then. And I got them, I checked them out, thought about keeping them. I didn't, I sold them a few months later. Um, and I don't really recall Jordans, but I, I noticed this window in here is like dipped in and the color on the inside is uh, orange. It's a, it's a bright orange. But past that outsole coming up, you have uh, these midsole. The midsole is two-toned. You have like, it's like a sail colorway and that British khaki colorway. And um, it's actually, it's a good contrast. The moon up past that, you have this standard Jordan 6, uh, you know, side paneling. And it's like zigzags and some perforations. Underneath the midfoot and up here by the toe, you have some reflective detailing like in uh, silver underneath. That's pretty cool. Then the suede itself is very plush. This is a very plush suede, like the most plush I've ever seen like on a Jordan personally. Then moving up by the ankle, you have this uh, stash pocket. <laughs> it's a button, uh, it pops open. And inside it had like a, a extra lace lock in orange. I'll give you a quick look. So it came like an extra lace lock. It's a Jordan logo on one side and Cactus Jack on the other side. It was inside this little pocket. So I'm gonna put it back for now, <laughs> close it up. Roll on to the front of the shoe, you got a bit of this outsole spilling up, it's glow in the dark outsole. Then run into this British khaki, you know, uh, midsole. And then moving past that, you got more of this suede all over the toe. And the suede is so soft to the touch, y'all. Like, but also you want to make sure you spray something good on this because I feel like you got some uh some like dark like wine on it, some dark beer or some dark liquor, it'll probably stain really bad. And you definitely don't want to have no stains on this uh nice, nice suede. The moving up past that, uh, underneath you have this tongue. This tongue is like in a brown canvas and it's a very nice uh, color, perfect color contrast for the shoe. Then on top of that, you got these flat brown laces or these khaki, uh, British khaki laces going up. Then like probably towards the top of the tongue, you have this uh, Jordan patch. Um, the Jordan patch is in this brown canvas. Then on top you have that bright crimson. <laughs> That's that orange looking color and uh, the Jumpman logo embroidered. Then at the top of the lace loop, you have this uh, clear, kind of like semi-translucent clear um, lace lock. And it seems to be glowing in the dark. We'll check that in a minute. And it has the Cactus Jack logo on one side, Jumpman logo on the other side. Then at the top of the tongue, you have this, um, it's the clear, it's the same material from the outsole right here on top of the tongue that says Jordan. And that's glowing in the dark as well, which is a very nice touch. Then going to the inside of the shoe, the inside of the shoe, uh, the sock liner is the same color as that tongue. It's the same material as the tongue, that brown canvas. Then on the reverse side of the tongue, you have this uh, brown canvas patch. Then it says uh, Cactus Jack. I think it says Cactus Jack on the front side of the tongue underneath, because it does peel off. Okay, it does. You can peel this uh, Jordan you know, patch off. I think it's buttons on all four sides. But you just peel it off, it says Cactus Jack underneath. Then the insole is a brown canvas insole. It says Nike Air on it. Um, I'll give you a better look at it. So this is a very nice thick insole. It's uh, very well padded and like got some weight to it. The left, I'm sorry, the right shoe says Nike Air and this shoe says Cactus Jack in that bright crimson. Oh yeah, <laughs> also comes with spare laces. <laughs> so it comes with the extra dark brown and the bright crimson. Then the side of the shoe comes with the British khaki. Uh, out of the three, I think the bright crimson would be the best, like the best color pop because it's not much on the shoe. Um, or you could double it up. If I did a double up, I'd probably do dark brown and the crimson, but what would you choose? Let me know in the comment section down below. Roll on to the medial side of the shoe, or the arse as I like to call it. It's kind of a mirror image of the lateral side, like the main paneling on the side of the shoe is the same, but it's a couple of key differences. One difference is down at the bottom, you have this uh, like in the, in the midsole area at the arch, <laughs> you have this uh, Cactus Jack logo in white. Then at the top, by the ankle, you got some of these ribbons over here. Um, look like you could hold like blunts in there. <laughs> I don't know what you're putting these ribbons, but whatever you choose to put in those ribbons, you could. <laughs> then up here by the ankle on this side, it's a zipper pocket uh, for a stash spot. Um, and it's nothing in here. I checked already. It's no like extra, you know, goodies. <laughs> but I guess you put your own goodies on the side there. Whatever you put in there is your choice. <laughs> Roll on to the back of the shoe. Um, it says Cactus Jack on the back of this shoe. I think the other shoe, yep, the other shoe says uh, Nike Air on the back. So I guess, huh, that's a good contrast. The insole on this one says Nike Air, back says Cactus Jack. Insole on that one says Cactus Jack. The back of the shoe says Nike Air. Pretty cool. I mean, I like the stuff like that. Um, flip it up, switch it up, whatever. <laughs> and uh, same plush suede at the top. You got a little bit of this canvas spilling out. Then this very huge very pronounced pull tab. The pull tab seems to be glowing in the dark and has a, a bright crimson orange strip going around it. And you already know me, 
pull tab gang all day. Roll on to the bottom of the shoe. And this classic Nike Air Jordan 6 also, but this time it's all like glow in the dark. It also has that bright crimson orange Jumpman logo in the middle. Then you got a few different things inside of there. It says Travis Scott backwards in black. Got the uh, Cactus Jack logo in the middle in black. Then towards the toe area, it has a uh, Cactus Jack logo, another one, the written one up towards the top. So I'm gonna go ahead and make these shoes glow real quick. I wanna see it in person, I'll see what it look like. I'm sure the camera will pick up most of the glow, but let's check it out. Oh yeah, these bad boys glow tough and it's kind of like flakes in the glow. Um, hard to kind of describe, but yeah, the whole outsole glows, the lace lock glows, the heel tab glows, and underneath the black light, this crimson orange pops real good. Let's see if I can make it do it for the video. <laughs> so yeah, you should be able to see those pops. Like, that's, this is amazing, y'all. I like the shoe a lot. I'm not certain if I'm gonna keep it or not, but I love glowing dark anything. So all in all, this is a very solid shoe. I like everything about it. <laughs> I'm not sure if these are comfortable or not. I don't think I ever tried on a pair of Jordan 6s like um, true to size, but my understanding is most Jordans are true to size. That's the way I would go with it. Um, as far as reselling these bad boys, last time I checked resale, it was like 400 bucks over retail, uh, which isn't bad. Uh, it could have went up since then, it went down since then. I don't know because people got their pairs. But right now I'm planning on, I don't know what I'm gonna do with these. <laughs> Help me decide y'all, should I keep them for personal? Should I get rid of them? Uh, let me know because I'm not a huge Jordan fan and I really wear the Yeezys a lot. The Yeezys last, they don't crease that much. They look good, they feel good. But this shoe was amazing. <laughs> so tell me what y'all think y'all should do in the comment section down below. Also, tell me if you guys had to pick up a pair of these Travis Scotts. Like the raffles, there were so many raffles out there. Some was paid. Like they had the sneakers going on. They had Travis Scott drop them twice on his website with the raffles. Like, were you guys lucky to pick up a pair? Let me know in the comment section down below. Once again, I want to thank everyone for tuning into my channel. Give me all the feedback. Show me all the love. I really appreciate you guys. Let's keep the momentum rolling. As my little son say, don't be a stupid, dumb hater. Like, subscribe. Holla. I put 10,000 hours in, we don't throw no tiles in Work, 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 work Work, 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 work Put the work in If it's money on the floor, girl, put some work in I'll be damned if what I do, I ain't the best at it Gotta go that extra mile, then the rest that it push Push, 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 put the work in if it ain't about no money, it ain't working. Yeah.